headless body found in no man's land. A man's headless body was found on Barnes Avenue in Rosetown, Kingston 13, a short while ago. The police are at the scene in an area called no man's land. There is an ongoing gang war in the lower Maxfield Avenue space, and the police believe the dead man may be associated with one of the factions. Dem deal would him mean. Real Spanish town style. Him had gone clean clean, an investigator told Irie News Media TV. Our news team understands that the body was wrapped in a gray tarpaulin, and placed along the roadway. Chubby wanted for murder in Trelawney. Trelawney, Jamaica, detectives assigned to the Falmouth Criminal Investigations branch on Tuesday named a man who is reportedly wanted for murder in Trelawney. He is Akeem Frame, otherwise called Chubby of Peel Street, Falmouth and Hague in the parish. Frame is wanted for the murder of Kamar Williams, otherwise called Kenny which was committed on Monday, July 31st this year. Investigators are encouraging anyone with information that can assist the police in locating Frame to contact the Falmouth Police at 876 954-3271 954-3271 Police 119 Emergency Number Crime Stop at 311 or the nearest police station. Three of four struck by lightning at a football match are still in hospital. Kingston, Jamaica Three of the four persons who were struck by lightning at an ISA football game at Charlemont High in Linstead, St. Catherine on Tuesday are still in hospital on Wednesday morning awaiting further tests. Three members of the Dintill technical team and an assistant referee were rushed to hospital after they were struck by lightning in the first half of the game. Everton Burke, manager of the Dintill technical team told Observer Online that one student, Asher Hutchinson, was examined and released Tuesday. His teammates Gabriel Anderson and T. Hamba Chin, as well as an assistant referee were admitted for further test. Meanwhile other members of the team were given counseling at the school on Wednesday morning, Irie News Media TV was also told. Burke stated that it was not raining at the time of the lightning strike but it had rained earlier and the conditions were overcast. So, thunder rolls and players are going down. We have a dangerous hit right now. So goalkeeper, linesman down, so we have some serious encounter people will have to break the stream just now, we'll try our very best to get as much. So, this one. So, far, the linesman also got in this people. It's really We're here in the Claremont community, the parish of St. Elizabeth, where a body is seen in a hole, which is approximately 50 feet down. And so we are now conducting a recovery operation. We are awaiting some experts from well, the scenes of crime as well as our CIB and the fire department and we will also be uh, supporting the residents as we seek to extract the body. I would not want to speak to the identity until we have so retrieved the body from this, this hole. Uh, the investigation so far over is that no foul play has been suspected. Girl falls into uncovered water tank, dies. Mandeville, Manchester, residents of Comfort District, a few miles south of Mandeville, were left in shock and disbelief after a little girl, said to be about seven years old, is suspected to have drowned in an open concrete tank on Tuesday. The child was identified only as Kimmy, a grade one student at a nearby school. Residents told the Irie News Media TV that about midday the child was attempting to retrieve a slipper from the tank when she lost her balance and fell in. They said firefighters who responded to their calls later removed the child's body from the tank. One resident, who identified himself as Val, pointed to the danger in having open concrete tanks. 
as a father, I feel it to know that a child lost her life like this. We need to take some steps to deal with safety because even adults can make a wrong step and fall in it. I don't even know the little girl, but I feel it, like my own child, it is just sad, he said. From now on we have to take things more seriously. This tank, it has to be covered now whether, water in, it is used for feeding animals or plants, he added. Another resident who asked not to be named, said she knew the child well. She is just seven. She just graduated from basic school and started grade one, the woman said. She, mother, is always around her four children no matter if it is day or night. She just got a job and had to leave the children in the care of somebody else, one resident said. If me did no say she wanted somebody to keep the children, I would have done so, added the resident. Residents claimed the children were left by their mother in the care of her spouse. But it was unclear if the little girl and her siblings were being supervised in the moments leading up to the suspected drowning. Workers from the Child Protection and Family Services Agency visited the community on Tuesday following the incident. On September 18, 2020 there was the suspected drowning of Narcha Smith, 19, a pregnant woman in the neighboring community of Settlement. Smith, who was visiting her boyfriend in the community, fell into an open concrete water tank while seeking cover in bushes during an attack by gunmen. LJ Green, 20, was killed by gunmen in the attack. You know, we need to take some steps to deal with safety. Because a tank like this needs to cover. Because even adult can make a step, a bad step or a wrong step, and, and fall in a step. Mm -hmm. So, you know, as a father, me just, boy, I yeah. not even know a little girl now, but me, 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 me feel it like my own. Yeah, yeah man, me feel it, me feel it, me feel it, man, me feel it bad. It's it, it just sad. And this was used basically to feed animals, right? Yeah, this tank, and... this, um, you know, the, the, the lady, you know, the lady for the woman, you know, we were a good friend, the man, she, she passed, gone a long time still, so, me used to be here with her and thing, you know, so me know the yard and all that, but, never really, me never really know what happened, just somebody pass and tell me, say, boy, a little girl, drowned down this one, it, it surprised me, you know, when we come and look and see, say, boy, I really did. You know? Boy, me really feel it, man. Me feel it, me I tell him. I feel bad for no say, boy. This happens still, you know? But for no one still, we have a, as parents, as guardian, you know, adults, yeah. we, have a, we have to take things more serious. I like this tank, you know? This tank, they have to cover it. You now, whether it's a feed animal, or plants, or farm, have to cover it.